Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will learn about the another concept that is code coverage. So what is this code coverage? As you see in our project, if you try to run karma start, let me try to run. Okay, so if you try to run this karma, sorry, npm test. So if you try to run this npm test, so let's try to run it. And you'll be able to see that all the tests has been passed, right? But we don't know actually if you try to see. So these are the source files we are having in our project calculator.js and also the main.js. So we don't know whether the test cases what we have written that is in the main.spec.js and also the calculator.spec.js. So it satisfies all the logic that whatever uh, it covers all the lines of the code that is there in, in our source files or not. So we don't know. So the test files what we have written is according to the test cases we have written. But we don't know that the test cases that we have written covers the entire source file, source code. So if it, if it covers the entire source code or not, so we don't know. So in order to check that one, so what we need to do, so we need to, we, uh, previously when we are doing this Jasmine test case and all those things, line by line we have, uh, we have analyzed and we have written the code, right? So test cases we have written it. But we don't know that when the project is very bigger and all those things, so whether we have uh, written the test cases covering all the source code or not so uh, we need to test it okay so in order to know that one so we have a package that is known as the karma coverage so these are called as code coverage coverage reports so if you install this plugin karma coverage it will give you the all the what i can say it will give you all the coverage reports so how much source code so what is the source code uh, that has been covered with the test cases or not which is which is the source code that is not covered with the test cases so these are all the type of report reports it will give you so this is very much useful when you are working with other companies and whether other projects or not so you need to have 95 percent of code coverage tests we need here that means the source code what you have written the logic what the javascript code what you have written you need to run the test case test you need to write the test cases in a such a way that the source code the test case has to cover 95 percent of your code Okay, so that is the code coverage reports. In this video, we will see how to add the code coverage report in the Karma and how we can check this code coverage. Let's try to see in this video. When we are learning about this testing uh, testing fundamentals in JavaScript, when we are trying to learn, I have told you that there are different types of your testing. So I have told you unit testing, e to testing, functional testing. So, so many tests are there. In this also, we will be having coverage testing also. So which will give you the analyze reports of this coverage thing. So there are so many tools available for this code coverage thing. So one of the thing is Istanbul. So Istanbul is one of the thing which will be used to give you the coverage reports. So in Karma, we will be using the Istanbul. So we will not directly install the Istanbul, but we will use the other third party plugin. So uh, Karma plugin. So where, where in that Karma plugin, Istanbul will be installed. So if you try to see the, the thing was the plugin what I will be trying to install is karma hyphen coverage. So this is the plugin we will be installing to get the coverage reports. So what is this one? So generate code coverage using Istanbul. So it will use this Istanbul plugin. So to generate the code coverage, Istanbul is in coverage tool. So it will give you the coverage, the coverage code, a coverage reports. Karma coverage is a plugin which is used, which is used in the karma. So as we are using the karma, so that is the reason I am using the plugin karma hyphen coverage. Now the easiest way to install this karma coverage is the dev dependencies like this. So we are having some examples. So here we need to we need to add it in the reporters. We need to add it the name coverage and in the preprocessor. So for which which files you want to generate the coverage report, we need to give it here. So coverage reporter in which folder we need to give the coverage reporter. We need to give it here. That's it. So we need to add it in the plugins. That's it. So this is the this is what it will be using. So we let's try to install this coverage report and. Uh, Let's try to do it. So now what I will be trying to do is, so here I will write npm install karma hyphen coverage. So I need to install it as a dev dependency. I am installing like this dev dependency. So now it will be the, this plugin will be installed. Let it install. So karma, karma hyphen coverage has been successfully installed. Now let's go to our, what I can say karma.config. Let's close all these things. Karma.conf.js. So this is the file. Now we have installed a new thing. So that is the plugin karma hyphen coverage. Let's add this one in here. Karma hyphen coverage. Okay. So I have added here karma hyphen coverage. And the another one, what we need to do is so what is the thing they have told? 
so we need to add the reporters the coverage okay fine let's try to go to the reporters we have already the reporters and here i need to add it coverage okay i have added this coverage now next one what we what we need to try to do is so we need to add preprocessors preprocessors means which source files you want to generate the coverage report okay let's try to add this one also preprocessors i will be using preprocessors so here you need to write this one will take an object and here we, we will be having star.js okay star.js and i we need to have the coverage that's it so now another one what we need to do is so let's try to see preprocessor coverage reporter so this is also one of the thing we need to have coverage reporter now here let's try to have it here coverage reporter and where where, where i need to generate this one the type i need to generate is in html type so that we can see it in the browser so we can also use the text and so many options will be there if you want miss you can go to the karma report so karma if you if you can open karma and in the configuration you will be able to see interaction or somewhere in the configuration you will be able to see the karma hyphen coverage so you'll be able to see about this one karma coverage also so now let's try to see go one by one here so type is html and the directory so the directory which i want to use so the directory i want to generate in a folder with the name coverage that's it so this all this is all enough for to generate the coverage report for our application now let's try to run the command npm test same thing so if i try to run this npm test command let's see what it will try to do so now a new folder will be created with the name coverage and in that coverage you will be having all the reports so how much the test has been run so how much um, percentage the test code the source code has been covered with the test cases everything you will be having in that one so let it run so that's it so here the karma has been generated and everything is done so let's try to go to here and if i go to the here you will be able to see one new folder has been created with the name coverage if i open this one so you will be able to see everything so these are all some of the files that has been created with the coverage report so with the help of the istanbul tool now let's try to open this index.html here you will be having index.html so i will try to open this one with the live server so normally also you can open it now here you will be able to see it the project so what is the coverage report it has been covered so 98 percent of the code is covered with the test cases it seems so this is the thing you it is trying to do so remaining two percent where it has been went is so you can able to see the custom matcher so this is 77.77 percent only the test cases the source code is covered with the test cases and the calculator.js so spec.js is 100 percent and the main.js is also 96.87 percent only it has been covered so 89.4 percent only it has been covered so how many lines it has been covered something like that it is trying to show it so now if i if you can open here so you can also open this calculator.js and you will be able to see the code so where this code has not been covered so here you will be able to see the constructor so this is the code bad requester we checked only with the arithmetic error only we didn't write the test case for the bad bad thing bad request error so for that reason so it is showing that this is the case where the test case has not been written it is trying to show it and if you come down so remaining all it has been implemented so not a problem it is saying so you can go back and here let's try to see about the main.js also where it has been not implemented so here if you try to see everything has been implemented and here this is the thing so in which it has not been implemented it is trying to say okay so like this so where what are the what are the lines that are not covered with the test cases you can able to understand so this is about the coverage report so this is very useful for us when writing the test cases so way because some of the applications when you are working in another company so they need to have something around 85 to 95 percent of test coverage should be there okay so without having this code coverage at uh, 75 85 to 95 percent they will not accept the code so we need to cover the test cases with 90 percent something like that then only so it will be test cases will be fulfilled so this is the thing so way which is very much useful and in the karma we can use this code coverage report like this hope you understood about this coverage how to create the coverage reports in the karma so this is very simple so we need to use the karma coverage plugin and we need to use it that's it so this is all about the coverage report so this is the end of the actually most of the things jasmine we have completed so uh, i i thought i think that i have covered almost all the concepts in the jasmine so this is the karma coverage report is also one of the main important things so this is all about this one
if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and also if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you